Good morning. My name is Sarah Lake and it's my pleasure to bring to you the highlights of the news this week. It has been a big week for news in Hastings with plenty of stories fighting out for space in the latest edition of The Observer. In the news this week we have a story of the local carnival queen holding onto her crown despite being exposed as an aspiring glamour model with an online portfolio of topless shots. We also have the tragic tale of a young girl who died while out riding her bike and the tale of two sisters who are fighting to raise people's awareness of drink spiking in local bars and nightclubs. So be careful if you're out this weekend. We have an update on a man attacking women in Hastings whose comments from the police who are now linking him to a spate of similar attacks dating back to 2006. Elsewhere, we have the story of a demonstration at Hillcrest School against the proposed changes to courses which only attracted three parents. There is also reports from the picket lines as council staff strike in support of poorly paid colleagues and news of how the economy here in Hastings seems to be suffering. Readers beware. There is also an article about how the council has come over all Big Brother and launched plans to catch litter bugs by using secret cameras. In entertainment, we have the news of an art exhibition by local artists at the White Rock Theatre Gallery, a preview of the latest show of Laugh It Up's successful Edinburgh previews, and all the cinema and gig listings for the coming week. As well as all of that, we have the very latest in sports news and a paper packed full of properties, jobs, features and photos. So don't forget, pick up a copy of The Observer today and don't have nightmares.